Kama Billiard says that it was toxic at Kaiser Chiefs Football Club, he was expected to perform miracles when he played for Kaiser Chiefs Football Club. And Billiard also said that he was not fired by Kaiser Chiefs Football Club. And also, Billiard was not happy when this guy, Samir Njokovic, as well as Bernard Parker, were fired by Kaiser Chiefs Football Club. Wow, wow, wow. Welcome to Kaiser Chiefs Corner where you will hear all the latest news related to Kaiser Chiefs Football Club. I'm a Kosi Amasha guys, former Kaiser Chiefs as well as Mamelo Sundance attacker Kama Biliad has finally spoken out after leaving Kaiser Chiefs Football Club during the negotiations of his new contract with Kaiser Chiefs Football Club where he was expected to take a salary card in order for him to stay at Naturena Village. We are going to tell you the exact words coming from Kama Biliad himself where he talks about the toxic environment at Naturena village guy. So Kama Biliad has since found a new club back home in his country in Zimbabwe playing for Yada FC where he is the best paid player there. They even bought him a brand new Range Rover guys. Also Kama Biliad was recently welcomed by the president of the country himself that is Munangagwa guys. So Kama Biliad is a big deal at Zimbabwe. So we're going to quote you the exact ways that was said by Kama Biliad after leaving Kaiser Shibu Club guys. He said that what was happening at Kaiser Shibu Club really, really hurts me. The fans of Kaiser Shibu Club will see Kama Billiard on TV playing for Kaiser Shibu Club, but what was happening behind the scene at Etna Churena Village was totally different. Those are the words coming from Kama Billiard himself, guys. He also said that to cut the story short, I was never fired by Kaiser Shibu Club, but I left on my own accord. The relationship between me, Kama Billiard, and other players was starting to become very very toxic guys wow 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 what was happening at Naturena village so Kama Biliad also went on to say that I was expected to perform miracles in the field of play for Kaiser Chiefs Football Club to a point where it really it really frustrated me even though I don't want to talk more about this situation but the dismissal of striker Samir Njokovic as well as Bernard Parker really really shocked me those are the words that are coming out of former Kaiser Chiefs, former Mamelodi Sundowns attacker that is Kama Billiard himself, guys. What was happening? That's, this is the question that I'm asking myself. What was happening at Naturena Village between Kama Billiard and some of the players there for the environment to become toxic for people to expect miracles when Kama Billiard was playing for Kaiser Chiefs World Club? But I, I honestly speaking, even as fans, we put a lot of pressure on Kama Billiard when he was still playing at Kaiser Football Club because we expected him to perform miracles but the players that were surrounding him were they as good as Kama Billiard at Kaiser Chiefs Football Club? If you ask me, my answer will be no. Kama Billiard is a top player. He did it at Ajax. He showed us at Mamelodi Sundowns in his country in Zimbabwe. He's a top player but at Kaiser Chiefs Club, which trophy did he win? absolutely nothing and the pressure was mounting and mounting and the environment as Kaba Billiard puts it became toxic between him and the players and he was shocked when striker Samir Njokovic as well as Bernard Parker were dismissed by Kaiser Chiefs Football Club guys what are your thoughts as a Kaiser Chiefs fan as well as South African football lover in general what are your thoughts about what this guy Kaba Billiard just said guys what do you think please comment below your thoughts on this news and please make sure that if you are new guys to this channel that is doing very well make sure that you subscribe put on those notification bells guys so that you do not miss out on any video that is related to Kaiser Chase Football Club Amakosi Amakosi